His body, baby, oh Oh, Lord, have his mercy Hey, I say I'm feeling all this, she already know this She want a bad man to come and video this I'm feeling all this, she already know this She want a bad man to come and video this You want murder me, hey, 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 hey. You a murder me, eh, 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 eh. You a murder, 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 murder me. You a murder, murder, murder. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to do a really kind of quick, easy eyeshadow look using the new Modern Renaissance palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills. Um, this eyeshadow look is really, really quite easy. I only use three shadows, well, four shadows. I use four shadows, and I love looks that look like you really, really took your time on it, and it's really actually simple. Like, you look like, dang, girl, like, who did your makeup? And you're like, oh, it was easy. It took me 10 minutes. <laughs> So yeah, I want to show you guys this look today. Hopefully you guys love it. So if you have any questions, please feel free to leave them below. Don't forget to follow me on all social medias. And on Snapchat, I follow everyone back. So please follow me on Snapchat and let's connect. So please enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. Let's get this video to 45 likes. That'll be cool. So, and I'll see you in my next video. Okay guys, let's jump right in. I'm using my favorite primer by Black Radiance. Nothing's new. <laughs> and now I'm gonna go, well first I'm gonna show you that I have clothes on. <laughs> so now I'm gonna go on with my favorite foundation which is L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte in the color Creme Cafe. And I'm blending that in with the damp Real Technique sponge. Now I'm gonna go on with LA Girls Pro Conceal in the color Cool Tan. And I'm blending that out and then setting it with another damp Real Technique sponge, setting it with some air, air spun powder. I'm doing, I'm using this technique so I don't get as much creasing as I usually get. When I don't do it. So I'm setting that and then I'm going to continue with my highlight and contour routine. And does anybody else have this problem with the darker concealers? It's like it separates or something. So I'm just mixing in the water or whatever it is. <laughs> but that's LA Girl Pro Conceal Concealer in the shade Beautiful Bronze. And I'm using that as my cream contour. And blending that out with a Real Techniques buffing brush. And I contour my nose with an e.l.f. contour brush. So now I'm putting some air spun setting powder on the sides of my nose just to accentuate the nose contour and it helps me con better contour my nose. And then I'm setting everywhere else where I put the concealer. I'm gonna put a little air spun underneath my cream contour as well because it sometimes can go down a little further and that's not really flattering to your face. Well, to my face. <laughs> Now I'm going to go on with the Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette and I'm using the color Shadow Play to set the cream contour. And I'm, you know, cleaning that up again. And I'm going, I'm going to go in with the lighter shade, it's called Subconscious, and I'm going to contour my nose with that. And I did my brows off camera because I am, am going to come out with an updated brow routine. But now using the 
Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Palette. I'm gonna go into my crease with Burnt Orange to start, and then to deepen my crease, I'm going in with Real Gar. And I'm blending that out with a little more Burnt Orange just to diffuse the Real Gar color. I don't want it to look too harsh. I'm just going back and forth between brushes just to give it more of a blown out look. And now I'm going to go in with a eyeshadow brush, a smudger brush with the color Love Letter and apply that to my lid. And with nothing on that brush, I'm just blending it out now. I'm going to reapply a little more real gar in the crease and then blend it out. Now I'm going under in my waterline with burnt orange. Actually, no, this is real gar. And then I'm going to go in with love letter on top of that just to smoke out the bottom lash line. And now I'm going in with primavera in my inner tear duct just to highlight that. You can stand by me anywhere. Putting on a bit of mascara to coat a light coat of on my lashes to prep them for falsies. And I'm using my mink lashes in the style Daisy by the company Southern Butte. I'll link everything below. Now I'm going to go with a nude eye liner pencil by NYX and just run that along my waterline. Applying a little bit of mascara on my bottom lash line. And now I'm going to dust away all the air spun powder and set my face as well. Now I'm going to go on with one of my favorite blushes, excuse me, blushes by NYX in the shade Double Dare. And now with my favorite glow kit, my favorite highlighters, I'm going to go in with Dripping in Gold. And of course I OD on highlighter. I mean, who doesn't? But I really OD on highlighter. So I'm just going to apply um, too much <laughs> and then probably apply a little more after that. She says she want murder. I'm the guy you never heard of. So pack it up and put it on a broda. Baby girl, I know you want murder. Your face, your eyes looking very nice. The way you want. Now I'm setting my face with the NYX setting spray and the matte formula. Now I'm gonna line my lips with the NYX brown lip liner. Oh, Lord, I make you slow down, slow down, girl. Oh, Lord, I make you go down. I'm going in with a liquid lipstick by Ruby Kisses, and this is in the shade New York, New York. This is the look beauties thank you so 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 much for watching i love you guys so 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 much see you in my next video bye